from kickoff as the Badgers play in front of a revved up home crowd for their first game of the season. Yeah, college game days bring an electric atmosphere to campus with many pregame parties fueled by alcohol. It's a culture a familiar face is working to change with a special kind of tailgate. Christina Laurie joins us live from Camp Randall with a very special guest to explain. Good morning, Christina. Good morning, Josh and Keeley. So we are out here with Monty Ball this morning, who is making headlines nowadays for all of the right reasons. One of those is a special type of tailgate that he hosts during all away games. The Badgers are home this weekend, but can you talk about what happens during away games? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's something that I really wanted to put on uh, for the fans, and it's, it's an environment I wanted to create it for families who obviously want to bring their children to the Badger atmosphere, let them experience it, and those who um, kind of want to get away from the bar atmosphere. And what I've done is I teamed up with Marcus Ball's Theater, where, um, first off, you're going to get great service from them, too. You get to um, eat and enjoy the football game in the Bistro Theater and um, take photos, hang out with me, and let's talk Badger football. What caused you to get so involved in this? Um, yeah, my, my goal ever since I retired from football and ever since my journey of everything, um, therapy, etc., has been to continue to give back to people. Honestly, it's the greatest reward. Um, I feel like I owe it to my fans for um, welcoming me back into... Uh, you know, their lives, you know, obviously from everything that I've gone through. Um, and it's kind of something that I, I just thoroughly enjoy. Once a Badger, always a Badger. And I'd be remiss not to ask your predictions for this season. Where are Wisconsin going to finish? I know they moved up to 17th in the polls this yeah. week. Yeah, it's, oh uh, gosh. I, obviously, our, our, our test is coming against Michigan. Um, but me being biased, of course, always being a diehard fan, I do truly believe we'll make it to the championship this year. We just really got to do it. We really got to pull through this year, and I think we will. I'm putting a lot of pressure on you, Jonathan Taylor. If you're listening, if you see this, you got to make it happen for these boys, man. And one quick tidbit, you were talking about those bleachers behind us. You have a little PTSD. <laughs> what what drill happened up there? Oh, my gosh, man. So um, we would have to, our strength coach would uh, strap us, chain us, excuse me, uh, to other players, four uh, uh, groups of fours, and we carry 100-pound sandbags up the stadium. Um, and it would be there would be no time. It's just the last team standing wins. So it's safe to say you will not be sitting in those seats tomorrow because you will never want to be in, climbing up those stairs again. But you can catch Monty here at Camp Randall. He'll be here for the game tomorrow and then catch him during every away game at Marcus Palace Cinema in Sun Prairie. Josh and Keeley. Great to see Monty doing so well. Thank you, Christina.